So I'm starting a new project and it's going to be a compact drone and it's only going to have one propeller and the way that it's going to actually redistribute the airflow is by using little servo controlled fins. So as you can see this design has been rigorously tested in G-Pod. But it's going to have a gyroscopic sensor on it that will be able to detect any change in angles or any movement so it should be able to self correct um, like say for example it's in windy conditions it should be able to straighten itself out uh, if you were to push it in the air it should also be able to uh, adjust itself so it didn't fall out of the air I'm planning on controlling it with an Arduino uh, obviously I want to keep the weight as low as possible so I'm planning on using an Arduino Micro so this drone is going to be fully designed in SolidWorks so every single component is going to have a 3D model associated with it which means that certain parts I'll be able to get laser cut other parts I'll be able to get 3D printed so what this will mean is that it will actually be really easy to follow along with and build your own uh, using my 3D models and my instructions. So obviously first of all I've got to make something which can actually keep itself in the air. Uh, but the end goal for this project is to make something that's fully autonomous. Uh, it's going to be an orb that's covered in LED lights that will be able to follow you around and light up an area or light up you. If you're into Skyrim actually you'll know there's a spell you can cast called Candlelight which will make a little orb of light that will follow you around and hopefully if everything goes to plan that's exactly what this project should resemble. So this is going to be the Candlelight Drone. Uh, I might think of a cooler name at some point so it might be renamed. If you're interested in this project you can subscribe to my channel and I'm going to try and post an update every week. Uh, so it shouldn't take too long to be honest, I've got most of the uh, design figured out already. So I hope you're as excited as I am to see where this project goes. Uh, thank you for watching.